If you believe you have any information pertaining to this case, you are urged to contact the British Transport Police by texting 61016 or calling 0800 405040. Alternatively, you could contact the UK Missing Persons Unit by using the link shown on screen and located in the description. This video features discussions of suicide, among other topics some may find upsetting. Viewer discretion is advised. Shortly after 10am on the 7th of April 2020, a young man laid down before an approaching train on the southbound tracks at Clapham North Underground Station in South London, England. The train's driver was unable to stop in time and upon arrival, paramedics pronounced the man dead at the scene. Following the casualty, services between Kennington and Morden on the Northern Line were temporarily suspended. Police are treating the man's death as non-suspicious in nature. Almost immediately, an appeal was launched to identify the decedent and notify the next of kin of his passing. Static CCTV images of the man walking along the platform shortly before his death were released when his body remained unclaimed just over two weeks later. It's been over a year since then, and despite extensive inquiries by the British Transport Police, nobody has yet come forward to put a name to his face. The man's ethnicity remains uncertain but it's known he was likely somewhere between 25 and 35 years old at the time of his death. He stood about 5 feet 7 inches to 5 feet 9 inches tall and had short black hair described by the UK Missing Persons Unit as untidy. He wore a full beard, yet it wasn't particularly long. His eye colour could not be determined. The deceased was found wearing a black tartan patterned woolly beanie hat, black framed glasses, a blue zip up Everlast hoodie with two logos on either side of the chest area and a white stripe coming down from the hood to the bottom of the hoodie, a grey jumper, grey tracksuit bottoms and a pair of blue socks adorned by a star design. A pair of light blue and grey Nike trainers, which it's believed he'd removed before jumping off the platform, were found at the side of the tracks. Also in his possession was a lighter and a bottle of over-the-counter eye drops. As you've probably guessed by now, he carried no means of identification. As of June 2021, this is just about all the information that's publicly available. In part due to the ongoing COVID-19 pandemic, this man's case has largely been overlooked by the media. As a result, this video is going to be a lot shorter than what's typical for my channel, but I still wanted to give this man a voice. He died alone in a deserted underground station over a year ago, and it's likely he hasn't even been reported missing since then. His story needs to be told so that his information, sooner rather than later, can get to the right people. The people who, undoubtedly, are wondering where he is right now. Again, if you believe you have any information pertaining to this case, you are urged to contact the British Transport Police. You can text them on 61016, or if you'd prefer, you can call them on 0800 405040. If you'd rather submit your information online, you can contact the UK Missing Persons Unit by filling out the form provided at the link shown on screen and located in the description of this video. Thank you very much for giving Clapham North John Doe a moment of your day.